Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. So in today's video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over the iOS 7 Control Center and the Notification Center. So the Control Center is a recently added feature only new to the iOS 7. And what you do is you can swipe from bottom to top and you're revealed with your, with your uh, control center and then on the control center you've got a quick access uh, button to turn on and off the flashlight which is the LED light in the back of the iPhone that turns on and that's a useful feature for looking for keys at dark or a keyhole and then you've got quick access to the clock app okay and you have quick access to the calculator right there and the camera you also have the option to play music and control music to a nice degree on the screen so you can um, lower the volume increase the volume go to the next track um, play pause and then you can also see the name of the song that is playing the, the, the artist and the album okay so they're right there and then you also have the ability to change the brightness on your phone so you can decrease you can increase okay and up top here you've got quick access to some options that you can toggle on and off this is the air um, airplane mode this is the Wi-Fi if it's white it means it's it's on and then you've got the Bluetooth do not disturb mode and the screen lock uh, button and that is the control center as of now Okay, so let's put that down and then let's look at the notification center on the new iOS 7. So you pull the menu down from uh, top to bottom and then what you have here is you've got three tabs. The Today tab actually shows you entries on your calendar, which I don't have any right now, and you can look at your stocks and any other relevant information that is coming up tomorrow. Okay, and then if you go to All, here you will see notifications from all your apps so if you have the game center app and it has a notification you'll see it pop right here if you have a PayPal app or if you have any app that has notifications enabled they're gonna aggregate in this area and then you can go to the missed tab in the missed tab you see missed phone calls missed text messages and stuff like that okay so that is the notifications uh, pull down tab for the iOS 7 and then I just wanted to let you know that if you actually go to the lock screen you still have access to the control uh, panel here and the notification center which is which is a fantastic addition it is it is a much needed feature and now I feel like the iPhone can be much more than just a static uh, congregation of icon images okay it still doesn't come to the level of customization that Android can go as far as you know having live tiles here live widgets but uh, it is coming close okay so that is the end of this video I'll be making some more videos regarding the iOS 7 features uh, subscribe to my channel if you like this video uh, give me a thumbs up and uh, also you can follow me on uh, Twitter and Facebook thank you very much have a good day